this is a bit lighter today, not as strong, but it's not smooth air. So we'll see how we go with a bit of the handling of it today in the lighter wind. Turns pretty good, but you have to um, know that you've got a large wing and not a little Light Sport 3 when you want to do a radical turn. And we've still got white caps, so it's but not many, so it's at least about 12 to 15, 12 knots I'd say by the look of it. Yeah, it climbs beautifully in uh, light winds, although I think that's, as I said in the other video, it's got a lot to do with me being at the lower end of the weight range for the glider. And it just climbs beautifully. It's so slow. Yeah, one thing I am noticing is I'm using different bloody arm muscles to control the um, glider. I feel it in my forearms. I must be. You know, that's what I've got the carbon base bar on the light speed, the light sport. So maybe it's just the angle or the grip. Well, am I enjoying my Malibu? Sure am. It's. Uh, I thought I used to be relaxing, flying my um, my light sport around here, but it's just um, in an entirely different league again. Flying the uh, Malibu. It's just so relaxing, just like going for a Sunday drive in a um, big American Cadillac. You know, the top down, soft top, huge car, about 40 foot long, real sloppy suspension, although I wouldn't go as far as to say that about the Malibu as far as the handling goes, but it's just that image I get of um, going for a Sunday drive in a big American Cadillac down the road and you know, no particular destination, just uh, out to enjoy the sunshine and the drive, sort of what it's like with my taking this for a fly. be a bit different when I start getting down on the dunes, dunes, but at the moment it's just um, really nice. Sort of lets me um, go down a cog in my flying, but it's also a trap there if I get too relaxed, although I don't think I'll ever get that far, but it's just so nice. 
I'm really looking forward to taking this inland. Um, I might not break any speed records, but uh, for me, on a personal note, I don't do well landing inland, as I suppose a few of us don't. Uh, I've stopped flying my light sport inland. Well, actually, I never flew the light sport inland. I used to fly my Sting inland, uh, Sonic inland. Um, bent a few uprights and went, nah, it's not for me. But in the Malibu, I think I could enjoy the thermaling and uh, doing a little bit of cross country at the same time, which would be nice. Because I still want to get to my 10 grand in land. I got to eight and a half, but haven't quite got to 10 grand yet. That's my goal. Go inland and get to 10 grand. I'm not that interested in going long distance. Just get up high and enjoy the sky. So here we'll do the spiral. And it's just, yeah, like, there's no energy retention in it at all. <laughs> I'll just um, do this when he gets out from underneath me. I think it's marks underneath me. Yeah, there he goes. spiral dive, diving around, and then to pull out, it's just, oh, okay, I'll pull out of the dive now. Man, do that in the light sport, and <laughs> my God, the bar pressure and the energy retention, you really have to be careful. You know, not that you don't have to be careful in any wing, really, but um, it's just, oh, so good to play with. This is my first landing in the chute, so we'll see how we go. It's not as though there's much wind down there. I might only stay prone, I think, till I get a bit closer. It doesn't have the glide of the light sport. Could have flared a bit harder in that rather than run it out, but that's an option when you got it. Come on, where's the bunny strap? That's all. Now here's a view of my new wing. Just landed down at Stanmore. And just relaxing. Lying back on my back looking at it and thinking of the great flight that I just had. And I'll pack up now and have a, some lunch and then uh, I'll have another beautiful flight this afternoon. See ya. Oh, and, uh, and just for all those people out there, 
yes, dreams do come true. It's taken me over 50 years to get here, so keep hanging on to your dreams, everybody, and uh, if you keep going after them, you'll get there in the end. See ya.